was her teeth today. He's going back down and hitting it like bam, bam, boom, bam, boom, boom on the back when it goes thrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
If your legs come down, you come down. You're down. Your legs are down. <laughs> now for the actual stab up to up. Uh, uh. Now for the actual stab freeze up into an actual elbow freeze. Once you're able to comfortably go from a stab up to your head, you want to be able to transition. And the way that the stab goes up into the elbow, if you do it correctly, it's really smooth. The hand that is using for the stab, the stab hand. Today's tutorial is sponsored by Pilgrim Cleaners. On Keepway, Beamer. Go get your shirt pressed up and do it with cleaners today. <laughs> Alright. So the thing about actually hitting the stab freeze to an actual elbow freeze, whenever you do it correctly, it's very smooth. The hand that is used to stab, that one is the hand that transitions up into your elbow. So the hand that is out, the one that is not stabbed, that always essentially acts as like the kickstand in your brace and pushes you up. So when you go from the stab freeze up into an elbow, and I lift up, and I start to separate my legs from my upper body, this is used to brace myself and use it as a kickstand, and this one simply transitions into the elbow on that back side. And I'm able to establish, again, using this as a kickstand, wiggle, 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 and then coming back down to the stab freeze. comfortably going between these freezes, I want you to drill going from the start all the way up to the elbow and then coming back down. This shows that you have complete control of this type of freezes. And while this is a stack combo in and of itself, I think this is a really good base, these three freezes, to be able to establish the strength, comfortability, and way to use this within your flow in order to hit a lot of other different stacks and freestyle moves within your round and your freestyle. So going from baby, stab, elbow, and bringing it back down, stab, baby, stab, elbow, stab, baby. So I would recommend going through all different combinations of these three freezes. Going from a stab to a baby, back over and over again to establish that comfortability. Going from a stab up to an elbow, from an elbow back down to a stab. Rep these out and get comfortable enough to where you can train the speed of this, turn on some music and hit these stacks on beat, and you'll be able to establish your control and comfortability with your stacks. Oh, I forgot one thing. This is really important. In life, you don't want to just be so one-sided. If you're on one side, you're missing the other side. And the same thing applies for your stacks. You don't want to just be able to go on your right side, why don't you just try to go to your left for a change. So this is a lesson in life. Break dancing can teach you about life and how to be open-minded. Don't go to one side for a change to the other side. The grass might be greener. And scene. <laughs> All right. Yo, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials and more great content. And uh, if you want to be fly like our friend Elliot the pig here, want to go?